Welcome back to another epic home theater room tour, everyone. Before we start, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, you know what to do. And if you enjoy these room tours, make sure you check out my playlist filled with many different home theaters that can potentially inspire and give you guys ideas for your own current or upcoming rooms. Today is episode number 33 and this gorgeous room belongs to Mike from Ontario, Canada. Mike's a massive Marvel fan who owns a DJ and a computer company and who's also a firefighter. Respect, brother. As a child, he was a massive fan of huge screens and movies, and every weekend he'd spend several hours at the Newmarket Cineplex with his friends and family. Six years ago, he bought a house which had a storage basement that had potential to become his dream home theater, and so the work began, and over the years, he slowly started to collect his equipment, and with a blink of an eye, he can finally sit back and enjoy making great movies with family and friends. Let's get into it. So this home theater space is 14 feet wide, 20 feet deep with a nine feet ceiling, just like every other newly built framework and riser went up and boxed the entire room with a three quarter inch MDF wood that was insulated with rock wool safe and sound insulation to keep it from blasting out of the house. He then installed three quarter inch drywall and went with blueberry paint to give it that same atmosphere as the Cineplex movie theater from his childhood. Carpet choice is a theater, massive wow factor, which I love. And speaking of wow, take a look at this star ceiling feature that's actually printed on a one piece vinyl that Mike put together and complemented it with a Lutron LED strip light around the room that just looks unreal. Before we go any further, let's check out this epic entrance lobby area as you walk down to the basement. To your left, Mike set up a pool table area that's also galaxy vinyl wrapped. And to your right is a recently finished minibar project that looks awesome. As you step into the next room, which is outside of the home theater room, the mood changes as Mike has showcased his favorite movie posters in frames and another entrance from his garage to the home theater, teasing you of what's to come. So let's take a look at this 9.1.7 DefTech surround sound setup. And first up are these BP7006 Bipolar floor standing speakers with built-in powered subwoofers from DefTech that are being used for left and right channels. On top of these, hidden in the cabinet are the two elegantly designed front Dolby Atmos speakers and they are the DefTech Mythos 10 on-wall speakers. In this setup, we actually have two center speakers that are located on either side of the DefTech Trinity subwoofer and they are the DefTech CLR 3000 high frequency speakers that are perfectly fitted in that masterclass front stage cabinetry. On the side wall of this home theater, Mike's hooked up four DefTech BP12 Bipolar speakers that are being used for surround and front whites, creating an epic cinematic atmosphere. And lastly, for re-channels up above are also the DefTech Mythos 10 on-wall speakers. I think the speaker placement in this room is an interesting choice. I bet it sounds incredible and I'm sure it will inspire a lot of you guys out there to be different. But we're not done yet as we still have two center and two back DefTech DI-8R high performance insulin speakers that's paired with the one and only voice of God, the DefTech UIW RCS2 series that do an extraordinary job on those Dolby Atmos soundtracks. Let's head over to his impressive custom-made built-in AV rack that's located on the side back of the room, which is beautifully framed with a unique trim showcasing his epic equipment. Starting off from the top, we have a Sony 1080p Blu-ray player that barely gets used and most probably will be upgraded to the new 4K player soon. Then moving down is the Nvidia Shield Pro for streaming, that's sitting on top of the AC Infinity S10 cooling fan that literally got replaced today with the T8 series. This is sitting on top of the almighty Anthem AVM70 preamplifier that delivers premium performance and convenience at a reasonable price. Definitely in my goals list. Below this magnificent unit is its best friend, the five channel Anthem MCA525 Gen 2 amplifier, pumping approximately up to 225 watts per channel. What a beast. And as you guys can see on top is another T8 Aircom cooling fan. In fact, every amplifier has one and next two are some of my favorite amplifiers, the extremely powerful NAD T977 and the T975 seven channel power amps. With these units, you'll definitely enjoy a sophisticated home theater system that will rival gig costing many times more. Check out the specs on these bad boys. You'll be blown away for the price guys. When watching a movie, a lot of light reflection comes from the AV rack and that's why Mike has also built a pretty cool breathable cover 
that clicks on using magnets. I find this very interesting as some guys would leave it open to show off the equipment. Moving on to the screen, this crazy expensive 120 inch ViewTech Great Dove 16.9 high quality and made in USA screen fits and looks amazing inside that front stage area. High quality screen calls for high quality video and Mike has chosen to go with the JVC DLA NX7 4K projector. This beast is packed with the latest projection features, complies with the HDCP 2.2, equipped with 17 element 65mm diameter lens and the list goes on. Definitely a great choice for an immersive cinema experience. For seating we have two of powered octane black electric recliners, three at the front and four on the riser. They look comfortable and match the theme with the blue under seat lighting, have slots for additional trays and of course storage under the armrests. The decor is pretty simple and clean in this room. Mike's installed a couple of acoustic panels on the back wall as well as some of his favorite movie posters in frames. Mike's future plan is to finish off the concession area with a popcorn machine, snacks and cotton candy with a mini fridge that's located in a small room behind the black door inside the theater room. Well there you have it folks, another killer, fun and beautifully presented home theater. I think overall Mike and his friends, Jamie, Alan and Kennedy Hi-Fi have done an incredible job. The front stage area is definitely unique. The star ceiling feature is a beauty and the equipment in the room is the definition of epic. Thank you guys so much for tuning in and a huge shout out to my Patreon friends for joining and supporting the channel. And if any of you guys wanna jump on board, the links are down below in the description box, where for as low as one coffee a month, not only you'll be supporting the channel, but also help me purchase equipment for reviews, potential giveaways for you guys, and help me achieve my personal home theater goals. So you can either click on the join now button on my main page or sign up to my channel on patreon.com that being said appreciate you guys god bless and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace